Hey guys, um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you all how to make your Windows computer look like a Mac using this thing called Rocket Doc that's down here. So what you'd want to do is open your web browser and go on www.rocketdoc.com and you get a screen that looks somewhat like this. You'll see this download button, you click on that and you just click on download Rocket Doc. You click on that and it'll just download go through the installation process now I've already downloaded it so I wouldn't want to do that so uh, once you do that yeah, so, now, so now once you do that and go through the installation pro process properly you'll get this icon right here you double click that and a dock will open it won't look the same it'll have a bunch of other icons and if you, you want to change the icons you just drag the icon up and poof it goes away to get it back see I just took our computer I take computer create a shortcut Rename it to yeah, just take the shortcut extension and pull it back in here. And that's it. Now I can delete, delete the shortcut. Yeah. And this is how you can change everything. Now uh, I've added separators. These are all for my browsers, for computer, my Microsoft Office, all my players, and some other random stuff. Now to put this separator out here, this line, just right click, add item. You can add the clock, the other the, the stuff. And you can add separator, right? So, like that's all you get. And then you right click, uh, sorry, right click, and you have your dock settings. Why you can change the general. These are the things I use. If you just lock item, then all you want be that's all this stuff I've out. That's it. So, I, I don't like that. Icons, you can change the quality to increase speed or decrease the speed. You can make it less transparent, more transparent according to what you want. You can increase the size, increase the size. I prefer the regular, regular bit. Oh. Yeah, and then you can zoom. You can increase the zoom, but not the zoom is this much. If you increase the zoom, then the icons will look bigger when you go over them. That's the only difference. You have the settings. You can change the time, the zoom width. Then the position you can have the bottom at the left, at the right, top, wherever I prefer bottom, it makes more sense for cooler. Then you can change the centering, you can take it on the right, take it on the left. Again, I prefer the regular middle. You can take it higher, you can take it lower, that's a point of what you want. I keep it yeah, here. Yeah. Then you have your style, mine is the Mac OS X Leopard. You can you can Astro Gray or Proto Steel or whatever. You press black and it just looks like the icons are hovering. And that's also quite cool, but I just prefer the regular Mac OS and Snapboard. Again, you can change the opacity of the dock of the background, the theme. Then you can change the font. You can disable the labels. So when I go over them, there are the labels. But I just prefer keeping the labels. You can change the color of the labels, etc. Your outline opacity can increase, decrease, or just keep it regular. Um, like then your behavior, you can make it bounce when you press it, whatever. So these are the icon settings. You can also auto hide them, so it goes down, and when you just go back down, it comes back up again. So that's the auto hide it. Nice nah, for keeping it like this. And that's about it with Rocket Dock. This is how to make your Windows PC or laptop take a Mac using a software called Rocket Dog. I hope I've explained everything in this tutorial. Thank you.